What? Come on, poisoned? Seriously? Alexei, don't worry. You were poisoned, there was a murder attempt. Putin tried to kill you with Novichok. It's impossible to believe it. It's kind of stupid. The, the whole idea of poisoning with a chemical weapon, what the They understood that what was unfolding in real time was extraordinary. They were solving this would-be murder. And I think Alexei saw the value in having cameras rolling, in having a skilled uh, knowledgeable documentarian just shoot what was happening. We didn't have a sense of what it would become. We just had an understanding. I think they just had an understanding that capturing these moments was meaningful. And it was in that spirit that we started making the film. Putin's supposed to be not so stupid to use this Novichok. If you want to kill someone, just shoot him. Jesus Christ. Well, it goes without saying that Alexei is the embodiment of courage. Whether you agree with his politics or not, what is without question is the man's, the man's strength of character and his almost superhuman fearlessness in the face of a behemoth of an adversary. What I'm trying to show is a complex portrait of this individual, of his courage, of his family. I want it to be very clear that you may not agree with everything the man stands for, but on his quest to install democracy and the great Russia, Russia of the future, um, he demands the support of the world. And I think that his story and his charisma is resonating with audiences. individuals in Russia who are keen to see this movie just need to be patient. It will get to them. We will find a way to show this movie in Russia. Um, the next film I'd like to make about the Navalny story is the film of Alexei's inauguration as he's installed as the first democratically elected president of the Russian Federation. Vladimir Putin, of course, is a mortal man who conceivably one day will not be the president of the Russian Federation. And I think Russia does not have to be predisposed to authoritarianism and this circle of corruption. Um, I think what Alexei offers is a vision of a beautiful Russia of the future. And whether you agree with that vision or not, um, more than anything, what he's advocating for is a democratic competitive election. And I think it would be a beautiful thing if he is allowed to compete one day.